the rock, and so she, as soon as she can, she escapes with the rock. Dr. Andy, is there such thing as insanity among penguins? I try to avoid a definition of insanity or derangement. I don't mean that uh, a penguin might believe he, he or she is Lenin or uh, Napoleon Bonaparte, but uh, could they just go crazy because they've had enough of their colony? Um, well, I've never seen a penguin bashing its head against a rock. Um, they do get disoriented. They end up in places they shouldn't be, a long way from the ocean. These penguins are all heading to the open water to the right. But one of them caught our eye, the one in the center. He would neither go towards the feeding grounds at the edge of the ice, nor return to the colony. Shortly afterwards, we saw him heading straight towards the mountains, some 70 kilometers away. Dr. Ainley explained that even if he caught him and brought him back to the colony, he would immediately head right back for the mountains. But why? One of these disoriented or deranged penguins showed up at the New Harbor diving camp, already some 80 kilometers away from where it should be. The rules for the humans are, do not disturb or hold up the penguin, stand still and let him go on his way. And here, He's heading off into the interior of the vast continent. With 5,000 kilometers ahead of him, he's heading towards certain death. <laughs> 